what is up everybody welcome back to the channel shout out to my buddy ron pastor ron god bless you ron um that's my man right there um thanks for your question a couple of days ago um this is a this is a like not even not even a ninja strategy it's it's just this this whole 2020 has been freaking crazy weird right and and as as the world shifts as everyone pivots as we go online and as the internet just becomes more of an asset more of a of a of a of a of a tool um more of an actual just way of life now right whether you're working for a company whether you're building your own company whether you're freaking going to school and you're a student in the seventh grade like my son it's like damn dude no matter who you are the internet is your best friend nowadays right everything is being done online commerce has shifted online and way before this whole zoom just completely just exploded as far as growth and everyone and their mother is now using zoom i was already using zoom probably for the past few years prior um i jumped on a zoom back in back in 2016 back in 2016 um when i first started my agency so as i started going out there and getting clients getting social media clients reaching out to business owners um showing them what i can do for them right helping them with their social media marketing helping them with their facebook advertising my whole approach was not pitching them over the phone. My whole approach was not even meeting them for coffee or, or, or lunch or, or any of those old school ways of trying to meet a prospect, right? Old school ways, right? Going out there and shaking hands and kissing babies and networking, right? Those, those, those days I left in the past. Um, and in 2016 is like, I, I jumped on, I jumped on online and I'm like, man, I want to start helping these business owners. And the best way to do it is to visually show them how I can help them. And that's when zoom was just, it was just a, a random little platform at that point. Um, I don't even know if a lot of people knew about zoom, um, back in 2016, but, but it was, it was a perfect software that I was able to use. It was simple. Um, it was free. It still is free. Um, I'm still on the free version. So the only way you the, the only time you ever need the paid version of zoom is if you're on meetings with three or more people. Okay. If you're hold, or if you're holding webinars, if you're holding live webinars and, and live classes or, 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 or any of that sort, um, then you'll probably be on the paid version. The paid version is not that much. It's like 15 bucks a month, but I have yet to need the paid version. I've been on the free version of zoom since I started since 2016, because my whole approach was like, man, if I'm showing these business owners what I can do for them online, how can I verbally explain that over the phone, right? I knew Zoom was going to be my best friend because it was free, because I can, I can screen share and I can visually show people what they're missing and how I can bring value to them all online, um, all while we're talking, all in a meeting type of chat room. And it was just a game changer, man. And, and to this day, this video that I dropped over here, I dropped this video a few months ago, um, 376 SMMA clients. That was a few months ago where I'm just talking about how, you know, and, and to this day, I've, I've, I'm now over 400. Every single one of those, you guys, every single one of them, man, was over Zoom, okay? Every single one of them was over Zoom. Um, now, when I'm on Zoom, I'm not like this. I'm not um, um, on camera. When I'm on Zoom and I'm actually speaking to a potential client, I actually stop my camera like this, and I, and I don't even show my face because I come from cells, so I leverage my voice. When I'm talking to people, I actually like sharing value and i like quote unquote pitching them if you want to call it that with just my voice i don't i don't i don't use camera right i don't use camera the only time i'm on camera is when i'm doing strategy calls um or if i'm doing tutorial calls like this for my youtube channel um that's when i'm on camera but when i'm talking to a real business potential client um i use just my i use just just my voice but i'm using zoom and it's this free version, you guys. So for those of you that are, that are trying to share value, that are trying to bring value to, to anyone, freelancer, you're an agency, whatever, you could be whatever. Zoom is, is, is an amazing platform, okay? And, and again, zoom.us is, is the actual website. Um, you can set up a free account and, and I've been on the free version ever since. Now, what I'm gonna do is hopefully I'm answering Ron's question. Can you show 
how you integrate Kartra Calendar with Zoom. Um, Depend on what you're trying to do. Again, if you're on the paid version of, of Zoom, then maybe you're, you're on the Zoom um, um, app and you're on it with three or more people. If you're on it with three or more people and you're doing different things like that, then, then maybe the webinar and scheduling appointments through Zoom is what you can do. Um, I've, I've never had to do that. I, I, don't, I don't do that because, again, I don't, I don't, I don't schedule it that way. I don't, I don't schedule calls through zoom although i know you can i know you can right um but again i'm on the free version and all i do is i just share the link so with my link this is the link that people can click on and then and then the password and the meeting id as long as they put that in they're on so all i need to do is just share this information share the link share the meeting id and share the password and so there's no need to integrate anything. There's no need for Zapier or there's no need to schedule anything through Zoom. Um, although you can, I just don't. So again, hopefully I'm answering your question, Pastor Ron. Um, I'll show you how I use the, the Kartra calendar and how I, how, I, how I use it with Zoom. So here's how I have mine set up. I have, I have my calendar through Kartra, right? Everything, I run everything through Kartra, you guys. My digital products, um, my landing pages, my email automation, my membership course, my affiliate marketing, uh, my calendar, all my sales funnels, all that is done through Kartra. So just to share some love, to show some love, Shout out to every single one of you who are subscribing that's into this type of stuff. But there's a 14-day trial for every single one of you in the description, profitwithkartra.online. Um, I always encourage people, set up a 14-day trial and compare it to what you're using. Compare it to ClickFunnels. Compare it to, compare it to Infusionsoft or Confusionsoft. Compare it to MailChimp. Compare it to Schedule Once or Calendly. Compare it to Kajabi or Lead Pages. Compare it to all these damn platforms you guys are spending an arm and a leg for compare it. Set up a 14-day trial, compare it. Um, reach out to me and I'll help you get off to a fast start and give you my time for free. But it's, the, it's this one software that has been a complete game changer for me. And, and the way I leverage the calendar, I do everything through the Kartra calendar. I integrate it with my Gmail. So throughout the day, I'll have my Gmail up, uh, my Gmail calendar, I should say, my Google calendar, um, because, it's, it, because that calendar sends out a reminder the google the the Kartra calendar has yet to send out a reminder when your appointments are coming up so i integrate it with the google calendar and it's the google calendar that alerts me when you know when appointments are coming up but um other than that i use my Kartra calendar for everything 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 and when someone schedules a call with me on my Kartra calendar, it syncs with my Google calendar and it's my Google calendar where I get the reminder. So here's the way I have it set up. As someone goes to my Kartra calendar and they schedule a call, okay? Um, here's where I have it set up. Let me walk you through this. So as I go through the settings of the actual calendar, um, this, is where I, this is where I integrate my Zoom link. Um, or embed or add whatever the heck you guys want to call it. Um, but this is where I put my zoom link. So again, I don't know if you're looking to do it this way, pastor, but, um, um, this is just how I do it. And this is how, how I've always done it. Um, so as I go through the settings of my calendar, it's this email confirmation, the, um, the, um, booking confirmation and the reminder. That's why I love the Kartra calendar because of the reminder. I, when I first started in 2016, I didn't have Kartra. Um, and I was out there reaching out to social media clients, trying to get, you know, clients on board, trying to get business, right? I would use the Gmail calendar, the Google calendar, right? And I would, I would set my appointments through there. But the only reason why that, you know, can only go so far is because, when you do set an appointment, it may send an actual um, um, like notification. When you add that person's email, you'll go to your Google Calendar, you'll schedule the appointment, you'll add someone else's calendar, and then boom, they get a notification, right? But as far as like a reminder, um, that's super important. That's super important. I want to be able to control that, that text. I want to be able to control that message. Um, and so that's a, a huge reason why I love this calendar because it sends out a confirmation and it sends out a reminder and I can customize that message. So here's what I do. The moment someone books an appointment, it's this message right here, this email, I should say. It's this email that goes out, strategy call confirmed. And in this email, congratulations, John, our strategy call is confirmed. Here's a quick summary. 
And then it just breaks down the event hosted by, which would be my name, and then the time. Um, and then right here is where I embed my Zoom link. So all I would do, all I do is I just click over that, I hyperlink it with my Zoom link, and there goes the link right there. And then I provide my meeting ID and my, my password, okay? And then also right here, in fact, let me see if I, if I have it inside of the image. Actually, no, I just have my, my, my YouTube um, link right there on the image. So if they click on the image, they go straight to my YouTube channel. Um, but, but that's how I do it. I simply just hyperlink it into this right here. Click here at scheduled time. And that's a reminder email that will go out right away. So for example, let me give you just, let me just, let me just do this. Let me go through the actual full, you know, steps so you guys can, um, you can see how it really comes out. So if I come to this calendar and I schedule an appointment, right? Thank you for scheduling. Now here's super, here's what's super important as well, you guys. Here's what's super, super important, okay? As a person goes to my calendar, okay, and they schedule a call, the thank you for scheduling page is super, super important. You need to have your Facebook pixel. On, you want to have your Facebook pixel. Now you don't need to do. You don't need to do any of this stuff. But if you're a smart marketer, you're tracking all this, and you're tracking and leveraging it through your Facebook Ads Manager, leveraging your Facebook Pixel. That right there, my Facebook Pixel is tracking the page. I'm tracking it as a page view and a at, and and a schedule. Now, why do I want to do that? Because first of all, again, I can. You know, I can create it. I I can track it with my pixel. So so now now I'm giving Facebook data. But but what I really do it for is to create an audience. Is to create a custom audience. So I'm able to create a custom audience around everyone who schedules a call. Okay, so that is a bucket of people that I'm able to run ads to in the future, or I can simply exclude them from seeing ads in the future. Now imagine if this was just just put this scenario in 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 your in your you know in your business. Imagine it in your in in your daily business. Whatever you're trying to do, whatever you're pitching, whatever your whatever your, your whatever your objective is in business, right? Driving someone to a landing page, getting them to fill it out. Driving someone to a landing page, getting them to schedule an appointment. If you're out there scheduling appointments, and again, that applies for anything. Real estate agent, they need appointments. A chiropractor needs appointments. A yoga instructor, they need appointments. Anything, anything, it applies for anything, right? This is something you want to do because again, if you're running ads for appointments, right? You're running ads for appointments. You want to be able to exclude these people who have already scheduled an appointment. Or what you can do is you can include them from seeing, you can include them so they see future ads if you're looking to target those who scheduled an appointment. So being able, to, being, being able to segment all this stuff, you guys, is super, super important. And most aren't even thinking about this. Most aren't even thinking about this. So this right here, you guys, I'm able to track that 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 schedule. I'm able to create a custom audience of those people. And again, leverage that when I go and run Facebook ads. Now, here's the email that I just received, okay? This is the email that my prospect will get or my client or whoever. The moment they go to the, the, the calendar, they schedule the appointment, this is the, the, the email that they, get, that they get right away. And then again, boom, there is my Zoom link. So all I did is I just simply copied this link, added my meeting ID, added my password, and put it right there and then boom they click here at schedule time and they're inside of my zoom meeting and then an hour before so the way i have it set up over here is i have it that booking confirmation goes out right away and then i have it set up where one hour before so right here one hour and i can i can um i can um um, um watch if i go into the edit i can change this if i if i want so look right here at the top, I can go out one hour before, I can go two hours before, this is the reminder. So this is what I, what I love about Kartra, is that I can, I can, I can, I can um, track this, I can customize this, and here goes another email that goes out with the link to my Zoom uh, meeting room. 
So that's how I do it, you guys. That, that lead is going to get a, a, a booking confirmation right away, and then they're going to get an email reminder uh, one hour before. Um, and then what I also do is I make sure that it's synced with my Google Calendar, and then I also make sure that those people are on a specific list. That's super important as well. So when you go in and, and, put, and, and send out broadcast, broadcast lists, or broadcast emails, I should say, um, when you go out there and set up a broadcast email, broadcast email is a one-off email. So if you just wake up one day and you have some idea and you're like, man, I want to email it to my list, and, and, and you have all these different lists, that's why this is so important. Now you can email a broadcast, send it to people who have already scheduled an appointment and bring value to them, right? Or maybe you don't want to send them an email. You can exclude them and not even include them in that broadcast email because you have all those people um, segmented on a very specific list. So it's on a specific list. It's syncing with my Google calendar um, so I can get you know, the notification when my, when my appointment's coming up, um, I, I leverage Google calendar for that. Um, and that's how I get people to schedule calls with me using zoom. Um, so hopefully that made sense. You guys, um, you need a good calendar system and really the good calendar system, a couple reasons for the booking confirmation, for the email confirmation and for the thank you page. So I know a lot of you guys that are using Calendly, I don't know if you have a, actually, you probably do have a confirmation page, but the, the million dollar question is whatever calendar software you're using, the million dollar question is when that person goes to your calendar and schedules an appointment, they put the time, but they put the, the day they click schedule the very next page, which is the thank you for scheduling. The million dollar question is, can you put your Facebook pixel on it? That's the million dollar question. And if you can't, then you're just missing out on data that you should be collecting. You're missing out on a custom audience that you should be building. You should be leveraging that. You should be allowing Facebook to create a custom audience. Um, and, and to do that, you need your Facebook pixel um, on that on that page, on the thank you for scheduling page. All right, guys, so that's how I do it. That's how I... I, I uh, schedule appointments using Zoom, um, and that's what I've done since day one, you guys. So, so again, I, I dropped this video a few days, a few months ago, three seven six. At this point, it's well over four hundred. We're deep into twenty twenty, um, and I haven't stopped. I keep speaking to clients. I keep bringing on clients. I keep bringing value to clients, and I keep scheduling appointments with clients um, all through the same process um, using Zoom, using the free Zoom, and um, to this day, man. It's brought, it's brought, it's brought fortunes and it's brought, it's brought, um, amazing, amazing opportunities, uh, for me and my business. So hopefully that makes sense. You guys go out there, set up a, a free zoom account, um, allow, you know, just, just what you want to do is you want to, you want to be able to, to, to visually show people when people allow you to give, to give you their time. Don't just waste it. Don't just try to pitch over a phone. Those days are over. Visually walk people through what you can do. And this applies for anything, not just sales. If you're a tutor, if you're um, um, a, 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 a fitness coach, if you're, a, if you're a, um, a freaking real estate agent, it doesn't matter. Whatever you're doing, if you're meeting with people nowadays, you're most likely using Zoom. Go ahead and leverage the, the screen share. And, and, and bring more value than, than you could possibly, you know, imagine. So hopefully that answered your question, Pastor Ron. Um, I'll see you guys on the next video. There's a 14-day trial for Kartra in the description, profitwithkartra.online. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Over now.